Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, Dave in the Man Cave. Well, in this video, what I intend to do is build um, a solo. So um, let's crack on with the video. All right, my first measurement, 16 inches. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do and give it the thumbs up, you'd be much appreciated. Right guys and girls, as you can see, um, there's more space at this side than there is over that side. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to clamp them up together, brace them and then tack them in place that I can actually make the frame on the back once it's all square. blowing a bit of a hole in that one but I can feel that it's not a problem right guys so far this is how far we've got now these have got to be all shaped up and rounded off nicely and so is that that side there and all the welds got to be cleaned up now i've got to put a bar across the top with supports because this is the main towing part here so the next step is really is to start the trailer and join the trailer to this part here before i could assemble this part that way I know what part I've got to strengthen and how high I'm going to work. So what we're going to do, we're going to crack on, cut some steel and start bending. So we bring this down. It takes a bit of time. This is the one, as I say, for Bridgie. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to tack weld this, which is wide. Oh, and I'd, I should, it'd be really appreciated. To me, that there looks spot on. So therefore, it's near enough. And this one also looks spot on, so it's near enough. But my father always said, if it's near enough, then it's spot on. So I've just squared this up so it's square that way and also upwards as well now the bottom of the trailer is going to be up here it's upside down at the moment so what I'm going to do now I'm just going to weld that along there 
I won't weld it all the way across, just keep it that it's good and strong. And once it's all placed together, I'll weld it then. But it'll be strong enough to mess around with. And then that's going to go there. And that's going to go roughly there. And then I'll lift it over and do a few of these welds to make this solid. You can see it come into shape. Well, there. right, guys and girls, thanks very much so far for watching this video. I do really appreciate it's it, and I'd be grateful be if you could subscribe. That's now, this is uh, part Lord one of there. two videos for this trailer build, so the next one should be following very shortly when I get it together. So, um, thanks very much for sticking by if you have so far, and it's really appreciated. And um, don't forget, hit that subscribe button, and you won't miss the next video. Thank you very much, guys. Really appreciated.